makes me crazy I dream about a baby Gazing on days and contagious You're my baby We know each other like the back of our hands Understand there's no mistake And I'm taking this you my dream Okay, we already had said John Waite Okay, so th this is the song with uh, John Waite, and the title of it is Change. Yeah. Nothing wrong with that. People talking, and they're saying that you're leaving. You're so unhappy with the way that you've been living. Well, this definitely sounds and feels like like one of those songs that you'd be in high school that you could really like gravitate towards mm. just because he's talking about like change and I feel like I feel like that's when you change the most like like that time period between like going into high school and graduating <laughs> yeah. is like you probably go through like some of the most some of like the most changes that you uh, up until that point in your life oh, you know what I mean Hands down, I agree. going from like a young adult teenager to like graduating is like yeah. now you're officially an adult you know right. yep so I feel I, I can definitely tell like this song right here is definitely like one of those songs that'll be like fun to your heart if you was like in high school when this song came out. Yeah, I agree. I agree. I always wish for money. change you do change the most but I also feel like that's when you encounter all of the emotions of like life you know like stress anxiety heartbreak love yeah. you know <laughs> like all these different emotions of just things that come like oh gosh and like I just I feel bad for all the people like that ever had to get bullied in school and stuff like like I feel that's 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 really bad that's not good yeah no, no Ho hopefully there was nobody that was ever bullied yeah, like well, school, I feel like, know? and it, those kids have it the worst because I feel like that that will traumatize a person for life. Like they'll never be the same. 
you know, and really live up to their full potential of who they're supposed to be, especially, you know, because you change so much, you know, from the person that you really are to this person of everybody made you who you are. And then, and then, you know, whatever else happens after that, it's just, you know, whatever ever happens after that. But, but yeah, I feel like you just, you experienced a lot, but you know, to say that Paul said that this song is actually about a wrestler. <laughs> About a wrestler. <laughs> so this song is about a wrestler. Did I read that right? Or I think it, it was like on a soundtrack to a, a movie Vision about Quest? a wrestler. Yeah, he yeah. said this song is was about a was a soundtrack was on the soundtrack for the movie Vision Quest, which was about a high school wrestler. <clears throat> okay. Yeah, that's what I thought he had said too. That's yeah, what I thought he had said too. Okay, we've never I've never heard of Vision Quest before, but yeah, so yeah. I feel like that's what he's talking about in this song too. Why are you looking at me like that? Your eyes are beautiful. Your eyes are really pretty, babe. Babe. See why you see? What? Babe, why y'all? <laughs> I be I be trying to be no, all. No, you looking at me, and I keep I keep sending that all that brown in there. I'm just like, oh yeah. Your eyes are pretty. <laughs> they are though. I need they you are. to focus, okay? I'm focused. I need you. I'm focused on what I need to be focused on right now. <laughs> <laughs> I am locked in. Hey. You always be trying to shoot I'm your good. shot in the middle, like like. I'm for real though. Babe, I'm trying to be all serious. I'm and not everything. in. I know. Have a serious discussion and stuff. I know, you just caught me off guard. Okay. Yeah. I just see you over there just just <laughs> It was all, it was almost like we were talking about about like about the ocean, getting lost getting lost in the ocean. I got lost for a moment. <laughs> I mean, there ain't no ocean over here. I don't know. I got I got lost for a quick moment now. <laughs> Look at JD so oh, BJ so smooth. <laughs> here, I was just like, I'm just trying to figure what what are you looking at? I know, I was trying to figure that out too. I was like, wow. Okay. Okay. Anybody meet their high school mm, 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 sweetheart mm, mm. in high school? Like, did you marry your high school sweetheart? Did you find, like, well, you didn't, you didn't marry your high school sweetheart. But did mm. you marry your high school sweetheart? Anybody? I'm just curious. Yeah, definitely, definitely. What is considered a high school sweetheart? A high school sweetheart? Yeah. I probably would say somebody that you, like, actually feel like, you know, like, like, like when you fall in love for the first time, yeah. but not just fall in love and be like, you know, and then y'all break up, but somebody that you might have like spent a good portion of your, like your high school years with. That's your high school like sweetheart? Like your high school sweetheart. Like somebody that you kind of, not necessarily you dated for a couple months, but someone that, that you kind of dated for a while and kind of like, like your first kind of like real feel with a relationship and you kind of felt like that feeling of, of like love yeah. or like even like thinking, thinking back. Like, hmm, I feel like I, I could just be with him forever. I, I'm going a, I'm to a marry him. Aww. We're going to go to college together. Yeah. You know, that type of feeling. Okay. Anybody do that? <laughs> <laughs> okay. I, I, wanna, I never knew what the real definition. That's a good question. Like, anybody, like, really marry their high school sweethearts? How many people, like, stayed with them for years? Even if you didn't marry them, okay? Like, mm. 10 years, and then y'all were like, okay. Yeah, you get on my nerves. <laughs> Just in your body, boy, 